First thing first, I gotta check Sydney out. It's the biggest city of Australia. More than 4 million people southeast of the country. The Opera House, built in 1973 by Danish architect Jorn Utzen, Harbour Bridge, built in 1932 in order to cross the harbour from north to south, It is pretty much built around the harbour, so a big port, but also all the water sports. Nature is everywhere in Sydney, from the botanical gardens to Bondi or Manly Beach. The skyscrapers blend in totally with the palm trees and the sand. Culture in Sydney is a bit British, a bit American, but the Australian people, no worries mate. Nothing can ever bother them. Should you speak a perfect English before you go? Nah, like most French people, when I arrive in Sydney, I have a school level of English. I could write a book, but I can't speak a word. Bonjour, uh, je m'appelle Flo. Uh, I live in a chalet in the mountains. This is very nice. Uh. So it wasn't long before Flo sort of uh, adapted very quickly to um, the Australian colloquialisms and uh, and speech and his English did improve uh, quite dramatically. Yeah. But after three months and a couple of beers, you understand everything. I'm just having a beer. <laughs> having a beer. <laughs> hey, I'm IKE. -E. The best thing to do here is to get a nickname. My name is uh, Mikkel. Okay, where you come from? I'm from Estonia. And actually in Australia I'm using uh, the name Mike because it's uh, quite hard for people to understand that my name is with uh, HK, not with KH, so it's easier to go for Mike. Just like Mike, I'm gonna change from Hello. Florian to Flo. Yes, just like go with the flow. Flo? Flo, yeah. Flo. Flo. <laughs> Flo. Florian. 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 <laughs> Not many people are born okay. English or Australian in Sydney, so everyone is used to foreign accents. There's plenty of immigrants. Greek, Swedish, Italian, Asian. Sydney is a big mix of cultures. I think all nationalities are welcome. That's great. <laughs> yes! But I found something way harder than the language to deal with. Driving on the left-hand side. Uh, 